Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 4. I'm your host, the Game of Darius. Last we left off, we had just gotten back out of the caves. Want to know about the princess who came visiting here? I don't know about that myself, but Lyda might. She's the one who takes care of the orphans. She lives in the house in front of the well. Thank you. And we found our way to Zenesta through the caves, which honestly took a little bit longer than I had expected it, but that was mostly because I backtracked. A uh, ton of weapons? Yes, please. Ooh. Scramaxis. I got the money for it. Plus three to the user's CP. Hmm. Alright. We'll definitely do the Scunner Maxes because it is a two hit weapon. Like, plus one to its hits, so, yeah. Uh, this does not grant additional wisdom, but the steel bat. It's, I mean, steel bat. Why would I not want a steel bat? Now, I could upgrade. Hmm. I swear from death once and then it's destroyed. Yeah, we're good. I like to think we're good. I know I've got that wrong somehow. We're probably not good in the slightest. But let's explore a little bit before we even bother with this Chino kid. If we can, that is. Oh, hi, guy. I've heard that one of the merchants here has some kind of deal with the Empire. I wonder what kind of person would do business with their enemy. Must have been very brave, very greedy. I'm gonna go with the latter. This town was on the front line of the war, which means it's the perfect place to set up shop over the war. Now the war is over. I beg to differ, but. Ooh. Guard standing in front of a thing. I bet I need to go to that thing when plot is done. Managed to get rid of the hex. There's still some monsters left in the buildings that that's why I'm guarding this Ah, excuse me. I'm guarding this staircase. Make sure no thing gets in or out. Water. Want some nice cool clear water? I eh. I hear that Imperial troops sometimes come here too. I hope not. A lot of a lot of murder then. Then I'd totally just turn into a dragon and be all like, haha! I'm a dragon. Now you die. So he'll see me if he see. Ah! That was fast. Whoa! You got me! Alright, alright, I'll go home with his sister. Damn right. I see you've come back. And you've got Chino with you. Yes, Sister Lyta. These people here were kind enough to help me find him. Well, thank you very much for your help. Alright, children. Now that everyone's here, let's eat. Now then. Why don't we go upstairs and talk? Yes, it's true. Her Highness Princess Elena did honor us with a visit. It was very kind to the children, who, as you know, lost their parents during the war. She left them many gifts of clothing and other things. I was very impressed with her compassion and generosity. What then? Where did Elena and the people with her go when they left? Well, I'm terribly sorry, but... Please, we'd be grateful if you could tell us anything. I know. Chino? You know, do you know where my sister, where the princess went when she left here? You bet I do, but I won't tell you. You caught me when we played tag before. This time you have to play hide and seek with us. If you can find us all, if you can find all of us, I'll tell you where she went. Hey everyone, hide and seek!
Oh dear, I'm sorry. I didn't intend for you to have to... It's alright, sister. Gino does know where what happened to my sister. I'll do whatever I have to get him to tell me. Well, let's go try to find them. Children from the orphanage are all hiding somewhere in the town. To catch them, find them all. Yeah, I can see how many you have left to catch by returning to the orphanage and counting how many children are there. How many children were there? I'm sorry, I tried to catch them. See, this is why you need locks. I, I wasn't trying to hide from you. I don't play hide and seek. That's for kids. Girl. Oops, you found me. Alright, I'll tell you where to find Nude. Then he'll hide under the eastern wall. Alright, so if anything, at the least, got ourselves a good old compass this time around so we know which way east is. Hi, yeah. During the war, this city was attacked by the Empire with their hex cannon, what they call the Karenide. Karenade, whatever. Up until just a little while ago, it was still so bad that no one could live here at all. Right. Eastern Wall. Okay. Try to believe that just a little while ago, this place was filled with that horrible black hex mist. Hex. Hex mist. Don't know why I can't work today. Oh, hey, there's a punk. That got me. Okay, I'll tell you where Konoko is. From here, walk six steps south, then 16 steps west, then north one step. After that, you have to walk west three steps, then south three steps, and then west another four steps. That's where Konoko is. I hate you. I... <sighs> do, do I... Do I have to write it down? I'm gonna have to write it down. No, tell me again, you little punk. Tell me again or I'll just freaking put a sword to your freaking throat and have you leave me to one. I don't like... Yeah. South, eh. West, 16. North, 1. West, 3. If this somehow leads me into a circle, I'm gonna freaking punch this kid off the wall. West, 4. Alright. Got it? Yes. Alright. Uh. South, eh? Wait. One, two, four, five, six. West. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I walk right into. Unless I miss. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 13, 16, 1, 1, 2, I'm gonna murder this kid, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, I'm gonna murder this kid. But didn't just tell me a general, oh, hey, that's where the kid is, sort of thing. No, you gotta be a little punk. Punk? You, where's the kid? Dang it. That's gonna be one of the most frustrating 30 minutes of my life. I meant to go up the stairs, not... Unless... Why would the needle not be north on the red side? You got me! Have you found everyone yet? If you're not sure, you should go back and count how many you found. Why no? We're about to... Yeah, okay. So I gotta look inside the hooses. Sadly. Because now that means that I have to go in... It's honestly better if I just use my eyes and rely on that freaking brat. Okay, now. Can't go in that one. I doubt that one of them would have gone down the well. 
Aw, you found me already. All right, I'll tell you where Gote is. Saw him go off towards the gate. I'm sorry, the gate? I'm gonna assume that he means the front gate. Ah, there he is. You. Whoops, looks like you found me. If you're looking for Nama. She told me that she was going to go hide on the stairs. There are so many stairs. Look at this. Look at all the stairs. I just used three alone. I already found this brat. I should head back in and see if they just disappear so that I can just casually go not care anymore. I don't know. Have I found everyone yet? Be able to get there. Maybe I should have just told you to go to the... This game needs a kill the children mod like Fallout does. <sighs> no, wait, I did go to the end, didn't I? That's where I found the girl that was upstairs. Was that the end? Is this the end? Because this is where I found that kid. Well, it didn't let me rest, so I guess not. Yeah, the path that he lead led me to would have been, like, right to the freaking inn, wouldn't it? <laughs> Talk to Big and Burly here. This house belongs to the magnificent Marlock. It's not a place for people like you to hang around. Got it. Hey, have you seen a bunch of brats? Town sure takes a lot out of you with all these stairs. Yes, I'm sure that's what's taking a lot of you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh. Oh, is it this stairs? I didn't think you'd find me so soon. Probably won't be able to find Moto so easy, though. All I can't see him. Not even from the top of the bridge in the center of town. I mean, this bridge? Alright, where is he? Not even from the top of the bridge in the center of town, eh? Am I giving everyone whiplash? I apologize. I'm trying to find a brat. Uh, children. Was that the last of them? Maybe I did find... Did I find Moto already? I don't know. Um, looks like there's one child still missing. It's Chino, isn't it? I suspected as much. As you know, he's very good at running and hiding from us. You know, said he was gonna hide in the cellar or something. This town has a large number of underground rooms that are not currently in use. As you may know, during the war, we were the target of a hex attack. Although the city all above ground has been purified, apparently the monsters still thrive underground. It's possible that Chino may have snuck past the guard and is hiding underground. Well, we'll go look for him then. You will? Oh, thank you so much. Good luck and be careful. I mean, honestly, the kid's probably dead already. It took us a good solid 15 minutes just to find the brat. The other brats. In that time, probably down there right now getting devoured by a zombie. Or worse. Seriously, was that the end? Because I did not get any healings. Did I? No, I didn't. I mean, not that... There's now a lady sitting at the table. Was that lady always there? I don't think she was. Don't you dare tell me that she was. Don't want to stay as 50 penny. Eat. 
I just don't want to have to do the freaking thing with the children again. Heck to that. Heck, I say. Alright. Let's go save a brat. Uh, I wonder if anyone's thinking to themselves, Man, Darius just hates children, doesn't he? Not all kid children. Mostly video game ones. What? One of the orphans went down there. That's impossible. I've been standing here watching the entrance all day. Or are you saying that I'm not doing my job? Ugh, I'm really thirsty now after all that shouting. Oh. I see the importance of the water lady. Water, get your cool, clean water here. I wonder if we'll buy water again today. Or do I just fail you until you get to the dude? Come on. Yes! Yoink! Haha! <laughs> Sucker. Oh god, what have I gotten myself into? It's gonna be filled with more hex monsters, isn't it? I gotta be thorough this time around. I just want to be thorough. Or ammonia. There. I'm telling myself that because I really want to just find everything. And I know that there's some useful stuff in here as well. And mice. Oh, look at the little guys. This hungry little rodent attacks all it sees with snap. You know what? Try to learn it. Oh, hey, learned it. Jesus! So, for those that don't know, <laughs> Snap is actually a pretty handy attack that lowers the defense of enemies. Which is handy when you have a primarily melee team going on or whatnot. I think they're also all faster than Nina, which kind of sucks. Well, at least they all went for version. Most of them that time. Yeah. Right in the face. Ow. And then ran away. Well, I did just crush his friends. So. What? I cannot tell you how many times that has happened this playthrough so far. One experience point until level up. Sadistic, I tell ya. Also, they pack a bunch for a bunch of rodents. I swear that's intentional. Ooh. Alright, first let's check out these shelves. Here. Still nothing there. Man, this place is a mess. Come on. Shelves. Protein. Increases defense, right? I'm always on the ooh giant cockroach. Takes the air when seriously threatened. <gasps> oh wait, do you guys have jump like the previous game? Hasn't used it. Didn't use it, but they're hitting for a lot. I mean, come on. No. Nope. Seriously threatened. How much of a how much of a threat is seriously threatened? I'm curious now. Ah, that's ooh. 717 damage, and sucker is still not dead. Hey, there is jump. Ooh, come on. I think... Ah, dang it. I had to know. I had to know whether or not I could learn it from these guys. And it's good to know now. I think they have a thousand HP. Because that one just died after... And swung it after Bursh and punched it right in the face. Alright. Oh, 
I just gotta remember that not all skills are learnable through learn through just watching a monster do them. Which is torment. Absolute torment when you got skills that you remember from previous games like jump. And no, jump was not a fantastic skill in the previous game. It was just I dig it. I dig jump. That reminds me of a scooter song. God, how far down did this brat go? More mice. They drop fish heads? I'm not gonna lie. That's kinda worth farming for. Alright, let's burn one. Step out of the other. Uh, and not flame strike. Just wild shot. Whatever. Stop getting hit. This is the worst game of hide and seek I've ever played. Nothing like getting eaten alive by a bunch of freaking mice. Giant cockroaches, twice your size. That's one thing. Fucking mice? Just regular old standard mice? That sucks. Why the hell did you not? Sometimes I just don't know. I can't even. Alright. Charge away. Oh. Really? Got a nibble in and then you escaped? Little punk. Oh yeah, that's right. Got an axis. I don't know how you properly pronounce that name. I'm gonna butcher it any single time that it's in any of these video games that I play. I'm not even sorry. For it is truth. Oh, well, it's in there. There's a barrel caught in the door. Won't be able to get in and open until it, while it's in the way. Well, guess the child's dead. Uh, they're gonna want me to try to... Oh, raptor claws. Oh, is that an Urshan weapon? It is. It can create powerful winds. It is a wind-based attack with four more power than the flame punch. That's cool. As I said, I think a lot more creatures are weak against fire attacks. I know that undead are, anyways. Alright, so I do it. I have to find a way to fall down it. Yes, I do. It's gonna be this one. Let's try this one first. Okay. I just wanted to make sure that there was not something like, oh, you fell into this hole, so. Yeah. <clears throat> Uh, Alright, you ungrateful little punk. Yeah, you found me. Thought no one would be able to find me here. And no one would have. And you'd be dead. Alright then, Chino. Will you tell me about the princess now? Okay, a deal's a deal. When the princess... Did I tell you how pretty she was? Anyways, when she was getting ready to leave town... I followed her. I ran after her all the way to the gate. When I got there, I saw these people come up and start talking to her. What? Who was it? Who was there? Tell me! I don't really know, but one of them was Marlock, the shop owner. Marlock is the merchant who lives here in the town. He owns a large sand flyer of his own. Some people say he even has dealings with the Empire. The Empire? 
I mean, Elena's been taken to the West? Excuse me, sister, but do you think you could tell us where we can find this Marlock? Marlock's got this big house right in the middle of town. He's got a bodyguard, too, who stands in front of it. Looks like we should have a little talk with this Morlock. Thanks for your help. I got a feeling I should save before even contemplating the idea of going to this shop. But I kind of fear that the shop is also... Yeah, the shop is like right in front of the inn. I kind of want to have another chat with the sister really quickly. Again, let me apologize for all the trouble Chino put you through. I hope you all are able to find the princess soon. We'll remember you in our prayers. Have you found Princess Elena yet? I wish there was something I could help do to help you, but I can't leave the children unattended. If you like, I can share with you some of the things I have learned over the years. They may help you on your journey. Sure. Very well. I shall first teach you how to guard. Hmm? It appears none of you is ready to learn this yet. To learn what I have to teach, you must have more than an uh, open heart. You must realize the importance of all things. And you must know how to ward. Return here once you have learned this. I will teach you. Seek not to take but to give. Doing so will save you all. And in doing so, all of us as well. Okay, that's right. So whereas with uh wolf guy there wolf I'm not gonna remember that name. I all I had to do was just tell him yes, I want to be part of your apprenticeship with him with or with the sister there. You gotta just kindly have the whole ward spell. Forget how to get the ward spell. I don't want to get it first before anything. Hey guys, what? I'll be all in an episode here. When we return, I will have figured out how to do the ward spell, and then I can train under the sister, which will be pretty all right. I think. I hope. Probably. So thank you all so very much for watching, and I shall see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.